Hello there, I'm Madra Hill, and welcome back to Sun Victoria 2. We decided to, to take, take, just do this and figure it out. I am going to declare to take Alexandria in an effort to try and take back the Mediterranean coast. It's really stupid. It's a very, very stupid decision. Um, I should not do that, but I'm going to. Oh, I do also want to consider what happens to the Ottomans. Ooh, when is the truce up? Three years, okay. Because I would quite like to take Moldavia. And take like that oil because there's not a lot of oil out there and it sells for a lot so what we're going to do is we're going to get ready and we're going to try and uh attack and see if we can just snipe them as quickly as possible it does look like a bunch of countries are going to pop out of the ottomans though which is very fun i think let's see if we can make this work I am concerned that I might not be able to. Expensive jobs. Acceptable minimum wage. Oh, that actually pushes me back in two militancy. Nice, because then I can just pass it again. Awesome. Gives me a free gives me a free pass, basically. Okay, how many is that? That is three, four, so I could do two of them at once. Great. Uh, boop, boop. Boop. Okay. That's a bit too much. Oh, I'm nervous. Okay. I really need to build some ships, though. This is getting a little silly, though. Okay, here we go. I am nervous. I'm very tempted to see how this goes. I think it can go quite well. The Qing Empire wants to ally with me. Buddy, that's not happening. Yeah, the Ottomans are having massive revolts. It's awesome. No. Let's go. Losing just a touch of cash. Sorry from all that education I'm trying to instill. Nervous, gonna head out. Nice to see you play. See you later, Juicy Trap. I'm back on Monday. Oh, he's nervous. Tensions. Okay, let's go. Declare war. Place in the sun. Alexandria. That's what we want. We want the glory of Alexandria to return. It's only five war score as well. Let's do it. Everybody accepted the alliance. Oh, Jesus. Well, I'm going to have to reload that, aren't I? Uh, whoops. Nope. <laughs> Looks like I forgot about Spain. Oh, man. Yeah, that, that, just, that just messes me up, doesn't it? That just... That just wipes me out. Look at the hordes of Italians. Oh, and the Polish being destroyed. A peace offer from Poland. No. Sold off. My ships. My ships. My beautiful ships. Who would do this to them? I've attempted to see how this goes, though. Like, could I maybe get another fleet together? Alliance from Brazil, you know it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh! Acquire Alexandria! 
Okay, I guess I just win. <laughs> what? I got exactly they just gave it up. They just completely surrendered. That's amazing. All right, let's take a look at our new state, which is not in my guide. Alexandria. Oh, it's a colonial state, isn't it? Of course, of course. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, well, not bad, not bad at all. Not gonna be very good, it's just fish and wheat, <laughs> but oh well. How are we doing for wheat? Did we need more, did we need more fish? We actually always need more fish, so. And we make a lot of grain now, so that's good. Um, well, that is intriguing. <laughs> Jesus, that's so good. All right. Catch up then. Let's just keep going. We're building. We're going to replace our navies. We're doing okay. We're trying to promote intellectualism as quickly as possible. And we're also just trying to educate our population a bit so we can make factories. There is actually a few proportions of the Valachian population that are actually all right. In Moesia, they're actually getting really close. You know what? I think Moesia is now fit to actually have... You really want to wait until they're 30% to be able to make craftsmen. Because uh, that, that's kind of when... It, yeah, it's literally up 30% is that extra 1% tick. But I think it works. Let's go. Let's build some factories in Moesia. So where is Moesia? I was getting ready to reload that, man. Oh, baby. Moesia. Lumber. Wheat. Wheat and cotton. All right. Not the best. I'm not going to lie. It's a bit lame. But we have cotton in Moesia. So we've got luxury clothes. Let's build a textile mill. And let's build a clothes factory. Stop. Stop making wine. You're making so much wine. <laughs> Sicily is free. Yes, Sicily is indeed free. Unfortunately, allied to Germany, so I can't exactly double cross them there. Um, these guys are doing okay in dire. <laughs> Very fun name. It's this state: cattle, wheat, cattle, and wheat. <gasps> Great. <laughs> and yes. Lots of uh, canneries. The only thing it's lacking is the steel mill. So we'll build a quick steel mill. And we'll just build one of those. Nice. So also shift click basically builds, improves all factories that are near their limits, which is cool. Uh, don't really want that. I'll delete that later. Okay, cool. Who else? That's looking all right. Thrace is looking fine. Galatia. Galatia is certainly getting very close to having enough. Let's take a look at Galatia. Fruit, lambs, lambs, and lambs. Not, not really my priority. Gonna just take that off, I am. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Amida needs work. Needs work. Iconian. Okay, Iconian needs not bad. Uh, sheep, opium, and wheat and fish. Okay, so I have iron over here. And I have iron here. So, Amida. How is the state of Amida? Not great. It's that that's that's still uh, it's still on its way. And we also have Vasperden, which is unfortunately quite a small state. But decently educated. Decently so. And it has that steel mill. Could you maybe increase that priority if you wouldn't mind? Thank you very much. Is the Kiel Canal built? I'm not sure. Hey, Enigmatic Rose is raiding. Thank you so much for that raid. I really appreciate that. Yes, the Kiel Canal is indeed built. Thanks so much for that raid, Rose. I don't know why it hasn't come up with a notification, but thank you so much for that raid. Really appreciate that. Maybe it's not set up. I don't know. 
Ooh, Rush is getting destroyed by Jacobin Rebels. This is... Yeah, spam those emotes. Spam those emotes, my subs. Welcome to new people. This is our Byzantine Empire. We're in 1895. We formed in 1891, I think. And we're doing very, really well. We take Galatia. We're waiting for infantry to take down a little bit. And I'm going to try and go for, like, Moldavia. Or possibly another state at some point. Onto the Ottomans. Possibly Bosnia. But I think Bosnia nationalists are going to make it pop out. And to be honest, there's so many rebels here. Their country's about to implode. I think the Ottomans are actually about to literally die. Which is just which is just wonderful. We're going to be looking around and see if anyone else needs any more education efficiency to try and help them out. Um, that's 3.8. 3.5. I, I mean, I really kind of want to go and make sure that everybody has the intellectuals they need to... Because it's 2% that it gives you the most research points. And it's 4... I'm not yawning. Don't make me yawn, Cornflakes. It's, look, it sounds like you're like making me... Be, oh, I think that's a really good emote, though. Yawn, try to make me yawn. I like the idea of that emote. But I still need 7 subs to get the next tier, so we'll talk about that later. Uh, Thessaly is really good. Macedon. Northern Macedon is actually acutely awful. It's only got 1.5%. There you go. Where? Let's take a look at Northern Macedon. That's this. And that's lumber. Just a big pile of lumber. Hey, Mike Barry, what's up, buddy? We made the Byzantine Empire, and look at that. No, we made the Byzantine Empire way earlier. But we we got we finished the event chain, which is really awesome. Aldra Yawn. That could be good. Exclamation mark Yawn. Because it really does make me yawn. Uh, we could... What's our lumber? What's our lumber? We produce quite a bit of the world's wood. And how much lumber? We also produce a lot of lumber, but that's mainly artisans. That's going to come into play when you get planes and stuff later. So we need to consider that. Ships are on their way, which is great. But now we can just kind of sit tight. The Lebanese nationalists have forced them to release Lebanon. Ooh, baby. Who are my allies? The German Empire in Italy. Isn't that amazing? That's so good. So Lebanon has just been re released. Silk. Lumber and iron. Not the worst. Establish protectorate. That would be easy. Cracking. You, you, or refinery and fuel. Very nice. Oh, expressions music. I got the prestige bonus. Okay. I could very easily beat them. Oh, I really could easily beat them. That's not bad, is it? Because because for some reason it's an established protectorate. Because I think it counts as a colonial region. Whereas these guys are all Syrians. Wouldn't it be better if I could maybe get Syria instead? Because Syria is going to force them to release soon. Dude, if I could get that, I would be so happy. Oh my god. These are a big pile of transports now. Which is great. There's electricity. Beautiful. And we need to start working towards getting better techs and good stuff. Ah, oh, but we also really need planes. Oh my god, I don't even know what I want. Uh, we do kind of want, like, combustion engine for airplanes. Yeah, we need to go down here. Oh, God, we're so far behind. It's because it's uncivilized. Yes, that's why. Kuwait's popped out. Yeah, it is a primitive nation, isn't it? So that would make a colony. So it would just make a colony. That's kind of sucky. So I, I means when I don't, I don't get to kill them completely. That's annoying. Oh, Arabia just popped out, and it's a, instantly a part of the British. Oh no. That's distressing. Oh well. Kind of didn't want that. Okay, pop them there, and in you go, boom, oops, perfect, go there, and we really do need to kind of work on getting more soldiers together in general, so let's take a look at a couple guards, we can get a couple Greek guards, which are always good, um, and artillery wise, I think we should try and actually just have, oh, we can actually recruit a bunch of artillery from Africa, oh yeah, give me that, give me that units. Love it. Yes. Uh, we probably also should try to get a couple, um, like, Curacao's 
to try and help out with some of this. It can be really good to have some good Curasaurus there. It's like, look at like four. And a couple engineers as well to kind of round out my siege stacks. And then, I mean, infantry is always good. Good God, look how much I can make in Galatia. So we're just trying to round up our, our army a little bit, get a little bit stronger and prepare for our next invasion. So they are peace in two years. Two years, okay. And I can't do that until I have a truce, damn, okay. But I really would like to take Moldavia or maybe Bosnia. Bosnia is kind of crappy, but it has lots of pop. Oh, I could take Serbia right now. It's still pretty crappy, unfortunately, though. Ooh, Benat. So many weird countries just exploding outwards for some reason. Russia is also having a very bad time of it. Um, and I could try to take... Because I do have a thing... To take that. I can almost make Romania. That's weird. I don't really want Romania. Yeah, release for Romania. No, I don't want that. There is something in the northeast. Yes, Trans Transcaucasia. If I own all of Tbilisi, uh, Tbilisi, Baku, and Erevin countries, I can release them and make a, pu a buffer state, which is very cool. Oh, wait, or is it just... Oh, is it just those actual provinces? Oh. Erevin, Baku, and Tbilisi. Tbilisi... Baku. Oh, wow, look at that. Yeah, yeah. And... What's the last one? Head of it. Destroy it. Cast Benad into the fire. <laughs> it's A-E-R-I. Oh, it's there. Wow. So I only need to take those... I, I, I need to take three states, actually. So that's actually kind of harsh. There's a lot of iron here, actually. But it's only about 120,000 people. So not very good. Not a lot of things I actually want here. Oh, I wish I could take the breeze, because look at that coal and that lumber. Ooh. Also things like Crimea. I mean, I'll be taking Russia later on at some point. Later on, when I'm ready. I just need to kind of gear up. Bulgarian independence. With the recent rise of unrest in Bulgarian lands, they demanded autonomy from Greek rule. What? No. All pops are Bulgarian. Release Bulgaria. That is unnecessary or never. Yeah, that... Never. Go away. Don't you try and take my own country from me, you jackass. Oh, we're doing very well. Uh-oh. Uh... What? Uh-oh. The Second Italian Restoration of Order to Sicily, to Annex Sicily. Oh dear. There goes my wonderful allies because... Germ no, Germany, call me in. No, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just gonna ignore it. I'm just gonna ignore everything. Why is Germany not calling me in? Attend the first Olympic Games, yes. If I don't accept declinedly, I'm gonna lose them. Uh, damn it, I really wanted to keep them. <laughs> they were such a good ally. Oh well. I mean, taking Austria would be pretty good. Germany's strong. Yeah, Germany is, you know, essentially unbeatable, at least with regards to me. They can indeed into space. Not a lot of very good resources in Eastern Hungary, actually. Over here is very nice, obviously, but... Oh, you know what? Actually, if we took Moldavia... Yeah, if we took, like, Moldavia and stuff, we could get Ostgalizian and get that coal. And Galizia Lodownmio. Beautiful! Balkan War. Hashtag Balkan Wars. Compound Steam Engine. Steam Turbine. 
then combustion, and then we're going to start making automobiles and airplanes. By the time I, and by the time I get those inventions, I should have enough um, like education. Should be good. I know sometimes you don't need no education, but this time I can assure you, we 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 need some education, please. If you wouldn't mind, please giving us education. My people, very uneducated, very stupid. Check if you can ally Italy again. Well, oddly, I can. Huh. I can ally them again. Well, all right then. Form alliance. Oh, hell yeah, I kept my allies, baby. This means they don't get to take Sicily. Which is very funny. Um, I mean, Sicily would be amazing to keep. I actually can't... I'm really glad they didn't take that, actually. Because if they did, then I would not... Oh, actually, Germany's not beating them up. They might get Sicily. Because that'll make them a great power, probably. Oh, they won't call me in again. There's a very weird noise outside. I hate it. It's, it's very annoying. Oh, it's my fan. Oh, God. Okay. I gave it a swift thwack, and it fixed itself. I was hoping to see that maybe Ottomans would like break out of Syria or something. But I'm very sad to see that they are uncivilized still. Which means I can never actually state them, which is really weird because they should be states. If I do conquer them, I maybe I, I might uh, cheat it out or something. Maybe. No, this is noisy fan. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a dumb-dumb. England's allied with Japan, by the way. That's weird. Well, this will be good to give us Moldavia. Moldavian Moldavia. <laughs> Moldavian Moldavia. Great. And there's also Bessarabia, but I'd rather Moldavia and get the access up to there. And then start being able to chip away at this. Oil well in Tira 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 Durba Durba Dur. Okay. Didn't 100% know where that was. Oh, it's there! Oh, brilliant! We just got oil. All right. Hey, Norway, what's up, buddy? How's it going, my friend? Okay, we have a little bit of oil. Nice, we can actually use it. If I have 1% Greek, Greek bureaucrats, yeah, but I'll never be able to get Greek people over there. I need to also encourage Greek migration, and that'll never happen. Macedonian nationalists. You what? You what? Macedonian nationalists? What wacky tobacco are you smoking? Five, six, seven, eight. Here we are. Do I have nationalism and imperialism? This is Victoria too. Oh, you mean the tag? Sorry. Of course I do, mate. That's like 1850. Good God. Imagine if I didn't. Uh, I guess because we do actually have some rebels. Ooh, Turkish patriots. Yeah, that's not good. Might need to vote for that. Landed voting. Can't give you that, mate. Otherwise, you stop being Byzantium. The cultures that aren't Lebanese become Greek. Oh, yes, I have 300% assimilation rate. Oh, that's a good idea. I can make them a state then. No, yeah, I didn't. No, I I do add. I do have a lot of cores. Yeah, I don't really want any of these. Do that. I want to make child labor illegal. There we go. Check the cultures. It is Mashriki. Let's take a look at Antiquia. Yeah? That is Mashriki. No current assimilation. Is a core culture. Is Mishriki a part of my culture? Let's take a look. Settlement hierarchic order. Agrees of ruling party, capital punishment, conservative, minority build. No, they're counted as a minority. Mashriki is not Mashriki. I'm just checking on the uh, thing. Nope, they don't have it. Doesn't look like it anyway. 
List of cultures. Mashriki is Turco-Semitic. Nope. So they won't annex. Damn. Bunch of Turkish pops. So they'll never annex. Damn, I've never been able to make them. Very annoying. Oh, we didn't even need to raise the armies. Never mind. Perfect. Uh, Valachia's steel mill is apparently having some problems. Don't do that. Because, mate, I'm going to give you some clothes. This produces 145. Oh, this is where we get all of our clothes from. So we're going to then suddenly have to start buying all of our clothes. That's annoying. <laughs> I don't want to buy clothes. Still building clothes there. I really don't think we need this. Stop it. Do I get the bonuses from that? Hmm. Not really. Let's keep it open. No, I haven't. Got, uh, yeah, I've had a few vanilla simulate events, yes, and they've caused me a lot of problems. That's it for this episode, guys. Do be sure to be like and comment this video like this series so far. I was Al Jogantini. This has been Victoria 2. Next episode, we're going to figure out some factories and then prepare to attack Ottomans again. Bye bye.